A Very She and Him Christmas. This is an album by She and Him. She and Him is Zoe Deschanel. And Him doesn't matter. M. Ward. Um, so Zoe Deschanel. And this piece came up on eBay and intrigued me. Listed as a CD, a very she and him Christmas. But the art, the cover art, is not correct at all. And so I, there was, there was no information in the listing. N nothing. The seller primarily sells music primarily is selling CDs, LPs, that kind of thing. They had no information with this. It was just a very she and him Christmas, uh, two pictures front and back. Um, what you see is what we're selling. <laughs> but I couldn't figure out what it was. Obviously not a production album. The background, this kind of red draping very similar to the backdrop on the correct cover art for the album but other than that definitely not right he's not wearing the right clothes she's not wearing the right clothes the poses aren't correct we've got some like Christmas bulbs or decorations they're not right. I kind of feel being added. So I'm wondering, well, is this some foreign issue? Didn't think so. I checked Discogs. Couldn't find any kind. Of, and I'm already very familiar with the album. Extremely familiar with the album. Didn't really need to check Discogs. I knew I was looking at something odd. Couldn't find anything. It was super cheap. It was at auction. Um, I wound up getting it for uh, $5.27 delivered. There was one other bidder. They bid very little. So I, I got it for about nothing. So it didn't cost me anything to take a chance on didn't have the look of being promotional in any way, as in, you know, some kind of a single. I do have a really interesting single, um, very nice piece in the collection, but this didn't seem like that. And so it came today, and probably I bought a pig and a poke, but for $5.27 delivered, well, you know, what the hell. It's an interesting oddity to add to the, to the grouping. The packaging, the sleeve, the sleeve right away is a giveaway, especially the back of the sleeve. Total, totally back blank. We do have a stamping, and the stamping is uh, guidedproducts.com. Did a search on them. And they sell all kinds of packaging materials, all kinds of different kinds of paper goods. So right away, I feel the sleeve is a bulk packaging product. The picture, of course, the picture on the website can't really tell all that much. All I can really tell from the picture on the website is what is this? What's going on here? And I get it in hand. It's actually pretty well done. Um, Semi-professionally done, I would say. It's got a nice border on it. It appears to be professionally cut. The printing is on the inexpensive side. I can see a little banding across the bottom here. Looks like this was printed on, well I don't know if it's inkjet or laser jet or whatever, but it was it was printed on some kind of non-professional printer. 
and it's got a little banding probably from insufficient ink for the color demand. So the sleeve is a bulk product. The picture is not professional. It's pretty well done, but not professional. And even the 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 draping is actually pretty good. It simulates the draping on the actual cover art fairly well. But his clothes and her clothes and the poses and the addition of these crazy Christmas ornaments um, I know I know I bought something that's not really special. Still don't know what the hell it is, but not feeling like it's going to be some kind of wow, look at what I discovered kind of thing. So I, I pull the CD out, and right away the CD is another giveaway. It's got a nice label on it. It's well done. Everything about this is actually pretty well done. Nothing about it is professionally well done. This appears to be a home done label. It's got all the tracks. The tracks are all numbered. Very She and Him Christmas. That guy and Zoe Deschanel. But a, a, a home job. So I asked myself, well, is, have I got something pirated? Pirated it as in like, in, in a good way, an interesting way. And I figure, probably not. Uh, she and him were pretty popular, as they should be. Uh, Zoe Deschanel. Um, but a very she and him Christmas is not such a huge album or such a rare album that it's going to be pirated. My feeling, when these were sold, all of the, uh, if you bought an album, they were available on vinyl. Black vinyl was standard, but they also did very Christmassy. They were available on white vinyl, red vinyl, and green vinyl. And the green vinyl was exclusive to, I'm forgetting, the green vinyl is exclusive to one distributor. 1,200 copies each of the white, red, and green vinyl so very cool with black vinyl being retail um, and if you bought and also available on CD but if you bought a, a vinyl if you bought a record it came with a Christmas card and it, with the Christmas card there is also a little download card so you could log in and use your download code and you could download digital files of all of the songs on the album. So great idea, very cool, super well done to put it in a little Christmas card, a little Christmassy envelope, had a little Christmas card, had a little download card. It's really very well done. And the sleeve for the album, one side of the sleeve has a big snowflake on one side. It's just very, very well done. Um, I wonder if somebody bought the album, got their download code, burned some CDs, and put together some extra CDs and packaged them up real nice and maybe made Christmas gifts of them don't know that's my surmise of how this happened because they went through a little bit of trouble they didn't just burn a CD and throw it in any kind of case you know they bought a nice little sleeve for it put a little bit of work into the cover art 
um, did a good, decent job on the label. So that's my best figuring. Now my interest in she and him is Zoe Deschanel. But my interest to she and him came from a copy of Grantland. Grantland, Volume 1, published by McSweeney's. I got a copy that had two bookmarks inside, two identical bookmarks. Don't believe the bookmark was originally with the Grantland. Don't know that, but I've handled I've handled quite a number of issue one Grantlands and never seen this bookmark in any of them. Never seen it anywhere else. Where it came from, I don't know. It can't be entirely coincidence that these bookmarks were in Grantland 1 because the bookmarks promoted a very she and him Christmas. And they promoted that a, pro, a portion of the proceeds from the sales of a very she and him Christmas would go to 826. 826 is Dave. Eggers uh, educational organization and a very she and him Christmas was produced by Merge Records and Dave Eggers has an association with Merge Records who's done some other things with them so how these bookmarks got in that grant one I don't know but it can't be entirely coincidental because you've got the grant one the 826 National, Merge Records, it all comes together somehow. I thought it would be cool with my two bookmarks for a very she and him Christmas, portion of the proceeds going to 826. I thought it would be cool to get the record and, and just consider it a nice little ephemera grouping. And the record is good. I highly recommend it. Um, Zoe De Chanel. Um, so I got the record. Got the black vinyl record. I thought, well, it's very Christmassy. These books mark needs the colors too. I mean, it's Christmas. I need the the red and the white and the green records too. So I got. I wound up with all of the records um, with the little Christmas cards and the download codes and the whole the whole nine yards and so I had a nice little grouping to go with these stupid little bookmarks um, probably my stupidest grouping probably the grouping that people would laugh at me the most for even thinking about assembling um, but nevertheless, I had, I had, I had fun with it, which is kind of like the point, you know. Um, and I hooked up with a guy who they had had a contest at the time. They had a contest uh, where the store that cooked up the best display for a very she and him Christmas. They would give the winner, you know, some kind of goodies. And one of the contest winners, I happened to hook up with this guy. And I got from him a poster. They made a 11 inch by 17 inch poster. It was folded, a single fold. And that's the way it was done. Uh, however many there were, they were all folded. So all the posters are folded. And I've got, I found another one since then, so I've got a couple of the posters. So I got an 11 by 17 poster promoting Very She and Him Christmas. And I also got a perfect condition pair of mittens. Uh, red mittens with white. One mitten says she and the other mitten says him and so that's is kind of a a fun thing 
And if you bought a record, if you bought one of the first however many records, I don't know how many it was, but there was a small number of records. If you bought one of the very first records, it included it included a large sheet of a very she and him Christmas wrapping paper. So very cool. I got I I got that from this guy also. I also have the email that he sent me about you know just a little email about how he did the contest and won and this is what he got and just a little bit of there's not really a lot of information there, but it's still kind of interesting provenance. So I got this perfect sheet, very large sheet of uh, a very she in him Christmas wrapping paper. And they also made, for promotional purposes, um, what they call floaty pens. Now, I don't know what the floaty part is. I never understood the floaty. Um, but anyway, they were pens with a very she and him Christmas on it and the Christmas theme. And I couldn't find any. Could not find any for sale. Made a contact at Merge. Uh, told him what I was looking for. Said, you know, I, I know you have these. I know you're not out of stock on them. But I also know that you're not technically officially selling them, which was true. They weren't, they had them. I knew they had them, but they weren't really selling them. I said, you know, I'd like to, I want to, I want to buy enough to be worth your while. I'd like you to do me the favor of selling me a very she and him pens. And as long as you don't charge me an arm and a leg, just tell me how many to buy to be worth your while. He you said, well, I don't really know, but you know, I'll tell you what we'll do. We should probably be selling these. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> we do have them, and we're not selling them. So I'll, I'll tell you what. Um, take a half a dozen of them. Um, and I'll give them to you for like 10 or 12 bucks. I mean, he, he practically gave them to me. Um, but basically, it was a favor for pointing out, hey, you've got this product that nobody can buy. And they did, in fact, after that, they didn't list them for sale for like $6, $6.50 a piece. And he sold me six of them for like 10 or 12 bucks. So I have a, a really interesting grouping of a very she and him Christmas. I have the black final, the red, the white, the green, um, the wrapping paper, the she and him mittens, uh, the pens, the CD, all to put in this grouping with these two stupid little bookmarks promoting a very she and him Christmas. Um, so this crazy little thing pops up on eBay. It's apparently, it's not even a pirated thing. It's just something somebody did. Probably gave them away or something. This one escaped into the wild, wound up on eBay, and I bought it for $5.27. Um, so this is one of those dumb little groupings. It was, it was just a lot of fun. But very appropriate at Christmas time to pull out the records and kind of put out my red, white, and green records and my and my mittens and everything. Also, they uh, she and him, Zoe De Chanel, they did a second Christmas record. This was just a year or two ago. They did a second Christmas record. Um, they had it in black vinyl and red. And they had a, a fair bit of ephemera. And most of it I thought was kind of dumb ephemera. Um, they had a rolling pin kind of thing and some cookie cutter things. and and But they had a a stocking 
a red and white stocking. I thought it was really cool. So I bought the I bought the second She and Him Christmas album in red vinyl and got my download code. They did the same download code thing. And uh, I got my She and Him stocking to hang with the fireplace. Um and that was all I did for the second for the second record. I wasn't gonna collect a bunch of, of stuff for that. And it was, it, I just thought it was fun to get the second record in red vinyl. And the stocking was pretty cool, so I did pick that up too. Um, but that's the story of a very she and him Christmas. My oddball CD here with Zoe Deschanel.